Dear Dan, what does it mean that I prefer strong, aggressive women for one night whatevs, hookups, etc., but usually end up in relationships with shy, passive girls? Aggressively confused. That's something you have to come to grips with. That's something you have to wrap your mind around because if there's one type of woman that you're attracted to for fucking and another type of woman that you're attracted to for relationships, at least the women in your life need to know that there's going to be more than one woman in your life <laughs> over the course of your life. That's kind of, you know, what you're describing is typical Madonna whore complex, hetero male bullshit about the women who make you dick hard versus the women you want uh, to be the mother of your children and to do your laundry. And you need to really reconcile those two women. There are aggressive women who are uh, gonna make your dick hard who are fit to raise your children. And that's really a problem. It's really a problem for a lot of straight guys out there is that there's the, the, this one type uh, of woman uh, that turns them on and they somehow in their brains some wire gets crossed and they think well that disqualifies that woman from a long-term relationship because she's just a sex object and not someone that I can put up on a pedestal and love and what you want to be able to do is uh, within yourself have the capacity to put somebody up on a pedestal and then every once in a while drag her off it and fuck the shit out of her and then <laughs> and then put her back on that pedestal and she should want and be able to do the same for you, because this isn't about a male-female dynamic. This is just about how relationships work. You want somebody that you can look up to, admire, and then blow a load on her face, and then continue <laughs> to look up to and admire.